hold down the red button to actually start the motors as you can see let's lift it up and you've got this large button one in from the right hand side obstacle avoidance I'm going to flick that on and I don't know if you'd have noticed that hopefully you can see the LEDs are flashing whoops there we go it's picked me up already <laughs> if I turn off the obstacle avoidance you can see the LEDs are not flashing and when I flick it on you get it flashing also it gets a bit jittery because there's something that close to it so this only works uh, supposedly works at three meters and above so we'll just see how it does coming into the house yeah, I'll bring it down a little bit because the house isn't that tall actually and I'm going forwards now and I'm on full full pitch and it's doing nothing at all well, let's take it along I'm still on full pitch see what happens when it gets to the edge of the house there we go now it's seen there's nothing in front of it so off it goes wow <laughs> that actually works <laughs> shouldn't be surprised really should I but let's just try it on the side of the house so it's obviously any, only anything that's in front of it we're going to come forward and it's stopped again quite nervous to give this up full full pitch but uh, should we give it a go see what happens there we go I mean it's slower for a start and again full pitch doing nothing stops again so it really does work let's just try it on a tree so try on something small I get lined up with it it's not really fair to do it any other way there we go and I'm fully on that going forward and it's not going anywhere near that tree now it will go forward because it's got past the tree so okay so this is the actual sonar unit itself here um it's mounted underneath the well, sort of at the front of the main body of the hex as you can see uh well it works doesn't it i mean it was incredible um it's really nervous going on full pitch towards uh, an immovable object like a house or a tree uh with a uh, with a craft um but it did work and i was well impressed with that being sonar it will work in the dark so obviously if you went into a very shadow area or anything it's not relying on a, a on a certain amount of light to work so that would be good uh, key point obviously it only works with stuff that is directly in front of it so it's coming towards it um, so uh, it can't detect up down or or to the sides but then you know if you're flying with obstacle avoidance i think perhaps you should be concentrating on going forward anyway um, that's it really yeah i'm pretty impressed that it works and very relieved mm -hmm.